friends welcome back in this session i am going to talk about one of the very important and easy to use tools available which is going to help you in drawing the neural network architecture schematics this is excellent and i came across this so i thought i, I can tell this uh, to my audience this is called nn spg tool illustrations of the neural network architectures are mostly time consuming to produce and the researchers teachers whomever is working in that area will definitely understand that it takes a lot of time to draw these architectures and to explain things this nn spg tool is very nice and it's very open easy to use tool which can create neural network architecture diagrams parametrically that's was the mo that's the most important point that you need to understand it helps you in creating the architecture diagrams parametrically and it is very easy to use the tool has got three options which can help you to uh, draw a classic fully connected neural network fcnn and it can go with convolutional neural network figures which are based on the lnet and it can also help you in in drawing the deep neural network figures based on the alexnet style so i will give you the link of this and this is all created by uh, somebody by name alex le nail so the architect, i mean i will give you his uh, uh, git account as well git account detail as well it is very nice it is excellent and i will give you the details about the citations as well in the description go through it this i'm sure you will like it let me show you the demo of it you got to download the files that he has given in this uh, uh, git link and once you download and once you open that html file Uh, which is available you can really find it very very interesting now see that we have got three architectures here uh, fcnn style lnet style alexnet style let's go with fcnn first you can see that we can increase the edge width you could see that here you can increase or decrease the opacity this is all nice you can change the colors and it's going to be excellent see this all these options are phenomenal you can try this out and i'm certain you will be very happy to use this so the node diameter can be changed you can see that so this can be used for your publications what he requests is to give citation and you can obviously do that and you can adjust the parameters in the architecture so you can see that you could see that here it's very very nice it's very beautiful very responsive and i can also generate random weights here so you can see that i can show the arrow heads clearly you can you can go with vertical or horizontal directions everything is very easy to use and this is something that i loved on seeing the next minute i i liked it so you can see that it's, it's all immediately uh, working fine and this is kind of system that will be very helpful for teachers in particular let's go to lnet style so you can see that here uh, we can increase the opacity of the filter border width can be increased spacing between the filters can be increased or decreased and you can see that here i can change the parameters which are related to the depth height weight width filter height filter width everything can be changed uh, max polling options can be increased you can see that here so it's it's phenomenal so you could see that all these the number of layers the the steps can be adjusted accordingly and you can download this and use this in your class teaching or in your papers or publications or whatever you can use this very nicely and go to alexnet style this is also very very nice so you can adjust the tensor opacity filter opacity spacing between the layers can be increased or decreased accordingly the depth size scaling it can be adjusted width size scaling can be adjusted so uh, the architecture parameters can be adjusted regarding the height width depth filter height filter width everything can be adjusted the vector length you can see that we can adjust all this and you can generate a fantastic picture for your reference and this can be used for teaching students or teaching anybody who is interested in learning uh, neural networks or deep learning content in a much easier and interactive way um, i hope you liked that if you have any questions type it to my chat box i'll try to find out an answer i'll give you the link of this so that you can go ahead and download and try it out and uh, that's it thank you very much for following my channel and content if you have any questions type it in the comment section if you like the channel subscribe thank you